Good morning, kids. Welcome to the five minute devotional. Hopefully, you are doing well. My goodness, can you believe it? It's toward the end of this week already, Friday. And、uh, hopefully, you guys are having a wonderful weekend that's coming up. I don't know how many of you love to be alone. Some of you these days love to be alone because you could be on your computer all day long. So, being alone is a little bit different. But the alone means that you can't do anything. Not going under internet, can't play Among Us, can't do Minecraft,、uh, or whatever it is it that you feel that God is letting you be alone to do. But the loneliness that I'm talking about is when you cannot do anything and you just feel, if you feel like you are just directionless. Well, today I want to let you know if you ever get to that point feeling like there's no direction at all, I want to encourage you to read this psalm. This helped Pastor Frank a lot during the time when I felt alone. And I wanted to let you know that I hope it will help you as well. So it's actually from Psalm 139.、Uh, it, was t- it was part of today's、um, Abba's Heart devotional. I'm not going to read the whole thing to you. You could read the whole thing by yourself. Psalm 139, 1 2, 12. I love the beginning. And actually, toward the end, too, it says this You have searched me, Lord, and you know me. You know when I sit and when I rise. You perceive my thoughts from afar. You discern my going out and lying down. You are familiar with all my ways. Check this one out. Before a word is on my tongue, you, Lord, Know it completely. My goodness. And then verse 7. Where can I go from your spirit? Where can I flee from your presence? If I go to the heavens, you are there. If I make my bed in the depths, you are there. So no matter where you go, God is with you. And I hope it brings you comfort just like it had for me. Because When I was alone, I just thought no one could understand me. No one u n d e r s t a n d what I'm going through. But I want to tell you today God knows exactly what you are going through. He's with you forever and ever. And today, if you haven't ever accepted Jesus or God into your heart, you say, God, I might not know exactly who you are yet, but would you come into my life right now? I want you to come speak to me. Because we have a lot of voices from the outside, and sometimes voices that come in and tell us all these other things. But you want God's voice. You need the discernment to know what God's voice. So bless you this weekend to know that God is with you. Have a great one, and I will see you on Monday.